and just to hear the chance, uh, what did that mean for you? Yeah, I mean, like I told Kirsten, it's nice. Um, we, we're working every day, grinding every day, and, and fans appreciate some little things in the games. Um, and we're ultimately trying to get the win. It's just, it feels good. How, how have you felt with the last 20 and the last 30 games? Yeah. Well? And uh, okay. Uh, yeah, you know, I've been. Feels like I've been treading water all year, but um, you know, still looking at the numbers and they're okay. So uh, just kind of waiting for the really, really hot streak. But ultimately, my swing's been feeling a little bit better. Been like today, both balls kind of through the middle. Even the double play against me, it's probably synchronous to the stay inside of it. So even though it's uh, an, an out, there's little little winds inside those that create things later in the game. So feeling a little bit better at the plate. What was working for you guys approaching the Cody that inning where the first six guys reached safety? Uh, I don't. Know. Kind of, we just had a game plan of you know we've never faced a guy before and two seamer change up, uh, kind of a cutter guy against righties, kind of occasional curveballs of lefties. So trying to get him up and be on the heater and we were able to do that in that inning. Were you sitting on fastball there? Uh, just trying to get a pitch to hit. I'm always on fastball though. I've never come off a fastball in 15 years. What is it out about watching Yon Moto during this one he's been on? Yeah, I mean, since spring training. I mean, the first time I ever saw him face him, he, he just knew. He, he commands all his pitches. He, he, he's, he's filling up each quadrant. It's hard to figure out what he's going to do next. Um, it's When you got that kind of stuff with that kind of command, it's, uh, this, this, is, this is what happens. Good stuff every time he goes out. We see a rookie like that, and obviously dominating Japan. But see him sort of build on the kids. No, I think it's more than just a rookie. I think that this is a guy who's never been in the United States. He's learning the language. He's learning Major League Baseball, and for it feels like every time he goes out, everyone expects him to throw a complete game shutout. Um, it's a lot on him. So for him to go out there and do what he's been doing these first few months, um, I think it's special. You, you talk about kind of feeling like you've been treading water. Um, I mean, it hasn't been bad, like you said, though. It hasn't, yeah. You haven't had one of these mm -hmm. yet either. Um, have you been frustrated? Have you been no. pretty even keel? Yeah, How you even keel. I never kind of waver. It's a long season. I don't ride the roller coasters. I try to keep the straight roller coaster the whole time. So, um, you know, I just stick with my routine. Um, it's evolving, right, Bill? Um, but, you know, just trying to do the same thing every day and just know that it's going to work at some point. Three grand slams for you since the start of last season. Just what does it mean for you to just come up with Yeah, it's just nice. When there's guys in the position, and you want to be able to drive them in. And, um, I'm not looking for the ground slam. I'm just trying to keep the line moving and get a base hit there. And ultimately, you're able to get it out.